And new this morning, a report out shows a dramatic increase in the number of teenagers who are vaping. What the CDC is saying today is that most of these people are reporting that they're vaping THC products. He says he vaped with THC, the primary ingredient of marijuana. The new study shows the number of high school teens vaping THC, the active ingredient in marijuana, is rising dramatically. Me going from seemingly perfect health to knocking on death's door happened so quickly that I wasn't even able to fully comprehend the changes that were happening. They were happening so rapidly. It went from smoking weed to overdosing on opiates within the span of a few years, and it's, it's fast. It's fast. Hi, I'm Tatiana. Unless you've been living in one of those end of the world bunkers or like outer space recently, you've probably heard that vaping, whether it's with the jewel, a pen, or an e-cig, is pretty bad for your health. We've seen the news, we've read the articles, we've heard the lectures at school, we've heard the lectures at home. We get it, vaping is bad news. We know that vaping nicotine releases cancer-causing carcinogens and toxic chemicals into our bodies that can cause breathing issues and EVALI, a newly identified severe lung disease caused by vaping. And we know that it's addictive, expensive, really hard to quit, and honestly, just kind of gross. But even though we know all of this and a bunch of us have quit or are trying to, vaping is still a really big problem in our community. Vaping is super popular today because it looks cooler than smoking cigarettes. I had only tried vaping maybe once or twice, and that was with uh, some family friends. Over time, when I was in high school, I noticed that right around junior year, sophomore year, that Juul was becoming very popular. Up until now, there have been almost 3,000 vape-related hospitalizations and over 65 deaths. Over half of these cases are people below the age of 24, and many of the kids affected had only been vaping for a few weeks or months. So what's going on? Well, as if we didn't have enough problems already, when scientists looked into the cases, they discovered that nicotine isn't the only drug to blame. Vaping of THC, vaping of marijuana is extremely popular now, and we've seen it rise uh, very rapidly over the last few years. And there's several reasons for this, one being the legalization of marijuana in multiple states, two being uh, the higher reward pathway activation by these more concentrated THC e-liquids and higher levels of THC in marijuana plants now. And number three, the popularity of the e-cigarette vaping dabbing devices, which are very appealing to adolescents and young adults. 